Hi students, welcome. In this video, we are going to study about absorptivity, reflectivity, and transmittivity. So students, see here. Suppose this is a diagram. In this diagram, here this is a material surface, and on this material surface, we have applied a incident radiation G, as you can see here. Okay. when this incident radiation is applied on the material surface the part of it is gets reflected and part of it is gets absorbed red as you can see here in the red arrows and part of it gets transmitted through the material surface as you can see here that is when the incident radiation is applied or incident on the material surface the part of it is reflected by the material surface as you can see here this one reflected radiation gr okay and part of it gets absorbed that is here this uh, red arrows that is absorbed radiation ga as you can see here and part of incident radiation gets transmitted through the material surface as you can see here this arrow okay this is transmitted radiation denoted by gt okay now further see here g that is irradiation okay this irradiation is defined as the total incident radiation on a surface from all directions per unit time and per unit area of surface and its unit is watt per meter square as you can see here okay now see here this reflected radiation is related to reflectivity this absorbed radiation is related to absorptivity and this transmitted radiation is related to transmit transmittivity okay now further see here by conservation of energy principle when we applied this to this whole system that is that is that is here seen this g is the total of gr plus ga plus gt that is incident radiation is equal to reflected radiation plus absorbed radiation plus transmitted radiation so now we will apply the conservation of energy principle on this system so here seem ga plus gr plus gt is equal to g as you can see here okay now we will divide all this whole equation by g so after dividing we will get here g upon g is equal to alpha that is absorptivity gr upon g is equal to rho that is reflectivity gt upon g is equal to tau that is transmittivity okay and g upon g is equal to 1 we got here so from this whole whole example we got here this equation which is alpha plus rho plus tau is equal to 1 that is absorptivity plus reflectivity plus transmittivity is equal to 1 that is unity okay now see here alpha is absorptivity or we can call it as fraction of incident radiation absorbed rho is the reflectivity that is fraction of incident radiation reflected okay tau is transmittivity or fraction of incident radiation transmitted okay now see when the incident radiation is absorbed it is converted into the internal energy okay when as you can see here this incident radiation is incident on this material surface and from this incident radiation some of the radiation is absorbed by this material surface and because of that this absorbed radiation is gets converted into internal energy okay now further see here black body okay black body okay black body is a perfectly absorbing body okay it 
does not is it neither reflects nor transmits incident radiation it absorbs all the incident radiation so it is called as absorb perfectly absorbing body so here absorptivity is equal to 1 rho that is reflectivity is equal to 0 transmittivity is equal to 0 when and this is our equation that is alpha plus rho plus tau is equal to 1 when we put these those values in this equation we got here alpha is equal to 1 this is for black body okay in practice perfectly black body does not do, does not exist okay now see here opaque body okay opaque body okay see when no incident radiation is transmitted through the body it is called an opaque body okay no incident radiation is transmitted through the body then it is called as opaque body for this opaque body tau that is transmittivity is equal to zero okay now we will put the value tau is equal to zero zero in our equation that is alpha plus rho plus tau is equal to one after that we will get here alpha plus rho is equal to 1 so for opaque body alpha plus rho is equal to 1 that is absorptivity plus reflectivity is equal to 1 so see further here solids generally do not transmit unless the material is of very thin section okay metals absorb radiation within a fraction of a micrometer and insulators within a fraction of millimeter further glasses and liquids are therefore generally considered as opaque okay now further see here white body see if all the incident radiations falling on the body are reflected it is called a white body okay when all the incident radiations are reflected then it is called as white body okay now for this rho that is reflectivity is equal to 1 tau is equal to 0 alpha is equal to 0 so now we will put these values in our equation that is alpha plus rho plus tau is equal to 1 after that we will get here rho is equal to 1 this is for white body white body for white body rho that is reflectivity is equal to 1 so further see here one thing here gases such as hydrogen oxygen and nitrogen and their mixture such as air have a transmittivity of practically unity okay now let's see the what is gray body so here see if the radiative properties that is uh, that is absorptivity reflectivity and transmittivity of a body are assumed to be uniform over the entire wavelength spectrum then such body is called gray body okay so further a gray body is also defined as one whose absorptivity of the surface does not vary with temperature and wavelength of the incident radiation so mathematically it is alpha that is absorptivity is equal to alpha and alpha at wavelength al this is absorptivity at wavelength is equal to constant so alpha is equal to alpha lambda is equal to constant for gray body now further see a colored body is one whose absorptivity of a surface varies with wavelength of radiation so that mathematically alpha is not equal to alpha lambda that is absorptivity is equal is not equal to absorptivity at uh, wavelength okay so students in this video we have understood about absorptivity reflectivity and transmittivity Thank you students for watching this video, like, share and comment for this video and subscribe my channel. Thank you.